tried blueberry fondue. Yeah. Mm. And you know what is this is about? Yeah. So uh, the lamp uh, is coming with uh, parsnip puree. It's just, just parsnip. We uh, fry in uh, butter, boil it in cream, and then uh, we puree it. Uh, red cabbage coleslaw. Yes. Uh, it's uh, red cabbage, carrots, uh, mayonnaise with uh, or a kind of uh, mustard sauce, which we mix to it to make it. Uh, yeah, it's like a red cabbage and mustard. What's that? Yeah, okay. Blueberry, blueberry powder is. Uh, we take blue blueberries, uh, put them in the oven for 80 degrees Celsius okay. for over 24 hours. Oh wow! So you dehydrate it? Yeah. Okay. I uh, figured. See? I told you. Yeah, yeah. I told you. Right. Um, I have a question. Yeah. And this is going to seem so uh, immature of a question in regards to because you're a chef, right? Mm -hmm. But you know what the, the powder tastes like to me? It tastes like an American candy that we used to have. It's like a lic not, not licorice. Mm -hmm. We call it fruit roll up. It tastes like fruit rolled roll up with dried out and then thrown in the blender. <laughs> and I mean it in a good way because it's still my favorite candy. Like it's really good. It's actually not candy. It's a, a fruit snack. But it's, it's candy. It's candy. It tastes really good. Nice. All right. And what is this? Uh, that's a uh, estragon potato. So okay. that's uh, it's. Uh, we take small potatoes, uh, local potatoes, cook them. We crush them into a kind of uh, puree. Yeah. Like a rough puree. Got it. Add butter and some seasonings, and then we uh, bake them again. Cool. And then the next dish. Yeah. So that's a slow cooked chicken breast with a fried asparagus. Uh, potato cake and pickled red onion and the uh, albufera sauce which is uh, a chicken stock base with uh, cream and yeah. seasonings. Yeah, I need to learn how to make that sauce. That <laughs> looks really good. I cook myself. I All cook right. daily. I cook for a lot of people. Um, that sauce looks good. I could tell it was some type of chicken stock sauce that it probably had a cream base to it. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a creamy... You make a, a very... Intense chicken stock, add cream and some uh, herbs. Awesome. Maybe tomorrow we'll give you the rotten shark. Oh god. <laughs> okay. yeah, I'm gonna get shot. Alright, <laughs> right. 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 thank you. So what do we have in here for dessert? Yes, uh, here we have a uh, baked Alaska. Okay. So that's uh, a sponge cake. We've got inside of it uh, vanilla ice cream. Outside we have uh, Italian meringue which we are burning. And then on the outside we have uh, a strawberry coulis, and then we have the, a blueberry compote, which goes over. Awesome. Here. And over here we have... Over here looks we like have, homemade ice cream. Yes. We, uh, we got, uh, got our machine uh, a few years ago, and we cannot stop making uh, different ice creams. This smells good. Uh, so we have uh, salted caramel ice cream mm. and a mint sorbet. With it we have salted caramel, uh, some crumble, whipped cream and a two-edged cookie. Mm. I can smell the caramel. <laughs> oh, it smells so good.